Junior Ben Brown is one of the most experienced players on the Ole Miss roster, yet he's still new to his position. He's done a great job, especially he only found out he was going to play center like a couple weeks before OTAs. So he kind of just grew into it, and he's uh, he's done a great job. For Ben, it was just the snaps. Like, that's that's it. Ben, Ben's a heck of an O-lineman. He, he guy's going to make a lot of money one day. His snaps have progressed for sure, but game by game. And, um, you know, like I said, we work a lot. Uh, he, he's a hard worker, and we work on it, like, every day after, after, uh, after practice, call it snap school. And I think because of that is the, the reason why he's progressing like he is. Oh, snapping school. Time for some tutoring. It's snapping school. It's snapping school. Every week he just worked really hard at it and uh, improved a lot on his snaps. And uh, I think he's been playing great all year. With snap school under his belt, Brown is charged with directing one of, if not the, fastest offenses in the entire country. Well, it is a little bit difficult, but I mean, we do it all the time, so you get used to it. And great thing to remember, just kind of keeping the back of the head like, yes, we are tired when we're running because we're 320 pounds, we're trying to run up and down the field, but the defensive line are probably more tired because they're not practicing every day, you know? So that's definitely an advantage for us. He's a hard worker as well that, um, and, and a great team guy. And a lot of people, a lot of players look up to him, especially on the O-line. And I think that helps just because me and him, we're, we're the leaders of the offense. He's a center, he, he, he tells the line what to do. I'm a quarterback, I tell the line what to do. It just complements, we just complement each other because we're always so focused and wanting to get better as a, as a unit, not just individually. Uh, I think the best thing about playing center in this offense is that you can really push the tempo, you know, just get guys lined up and get set and uh, all our guys will ball in. You know, I mean, that's just a great thing. All the offensive linemen, all the wide receivers, running backs, tight ends, quarterbacks, we're all balled in, and so we just have a mindset to where we're going to get set and we're going to get lined up as fast as possible. But it is, it is pretty fun to be able to help in pushing the tempo with that, so I, I enjoy that. Although playing center is Brown's primary role for this Rebel offense. Where, where the camera is. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> Where's Waldo? There he is. He is also a key factor to the team's speedy tempo and upbeat disposition. He's, he has a lot of energy all the time, tries to maintain that juice, as we call it, on the uh, on the offensive side of the ball. Well, he yeah, because he's always drinking sugar all the time and eating sugar, so he's well, he always has his sugar rushes. So he's, uh yeah, he's always just fired up and... He's just like a little kid out there. Hey, I bet the camera got me doing a weird face. Really? <laughs> What's it like stretching since the last time you were mic'd up? <laughs> What'd you say? What's it like stretching for the first time since the last time you were mic'd up? Just like the last time I was mic'd up. Pretty good. <laughs> I like our telepathy going. <laughs> this is what happens when you're mic'd up until you can't get us. We have mental telepathy. <laughs> We, we communicate with our brains. <laughs> We're like brothers, but closer. <laughs> hey, you want to say something to the microphone? Hi. Hey, get out! Don't hurt me. Oh my God. Me and Peyton were trying to decide if he could sneak out when we were doing fast rush and go get canes. <laughs> Dude, being mic'd up for practice, just like, it helps the mood out on a Tuesday. Yeah, yeah that'll help the mood out on a Tuesday. Canes. <laughs> Brown has grown and adapted throughout his time as an Ole Miss Rebel, accumulating success due to his positive mindset on and off the field. With the years of all him playing all them refs, he's just gotten way more comfortable with the ball, and he's really just made the most of his opportunity playing for the Ole Miss Rebels, so he's really, really grown into his own, and he's just leading the group. I think it's all about his mindset. Every week he just has a very positive mindset. Just tenacity and toughness, you know, just every single snap, just having a one rep mentality, you know. Attack one rep <clears throat> at a time and then go to the next play. And then attack that play and then go to the next play onward. You know, I've just I've had some great role models to look at and uh, to model after. This is just having all these teammates has been great and uh, want to change it for anything. <laughs>